So hello and welcome to an alfresco edition of Airfield Mixologist. Um, so what I'm going to try and do today, because the weather is reasonably okay, uh, I'm going to try and do as much of the kind of outdoors things as I possibly can, and that includes taking the pulley of the air compressor, uh, and then I'm going to show you what I'm going to try and do. I'm going to try and get the air cleaner off as well. And I'm going to try and take the key off the Lister D. Um, so I'm going to start prepping all that stuff up and then I'll, I'll show you kind of step by step what I'm doing. Okay, so I've got the puller set up here roughly. And what I need to do now is I need to, I'm going to heat up the, the flywheel a little bit and then attempt to to take it out just, just so that it expands a bit, makes it easier. And I also used a bit of of BB blaster in here to, to give it a bit of lubrication. Um, so let's heat it up a bit. And what I'm trying to do here is purposefully I'm trying to heat only the wheel and not the shaft. So I'm trying to keep the heat as much as I can on the wheel and away from the shaft so that the wheel expands more on the shaft. And also on a cold day it has the it has the other benefit of giving you you know a bit of heat the heat gun which is always welcome. So I want to show you here a bit what's happening at the moment. So I decided to drain the plug uh, for the air compressor uh, just to see you know, what it was. And actually before any oil came out, uh, water came out and some gunk. And now I'm going to check this out. This is like, I don't know if you can see it from, from there. Let me let me get a light on there. I hope you can see it there. It's all like gunk. It's all a gunky mess inside there. And now what I'm gonna try and do with this. So I'm gonna try and ah look at this. This is disgusting. Look at this. So obviously it is a good job uh, that I didn't try and 
and use this compressor in any way because this is just this is ridiculous uh, so well, obviously it's a good job I decided to rebuild it isn't it so yeah what I'm going to do is I'm going to keep trying I'm going to keep going here this is ah, and look at this this is also what's coming out of it so evidently it was the right thing to try and try and give it a give it a build this is this is not lubricating or not doing anything so obviously look at this this is disgusting great okay so I carry on so I carry on chipping away uh, at this disgusting mess um, and I'll give you an update when I finish and the other thing also I wanted to show you was the air cleaner which I've taken out here uh, this actually doesn't look too bad uh, but this does look a bit bad uh, so this will need a bit of cleaning uh, a bit of attention uh, but at least I've got the air cleaner out uh, and I've got lots of stuff out of the engine so I can start doing a bit of uh, doing a bit of work on it Okay, so let's have a look what comes out of here and any minute now whoa bit of water but mainly oil so yeah I think I'm happy with that look at that it's disgusting color of it uh, but yeah at least there wasn't there wasn't a lot of water in it Okay, so unfortunately it's time for me to end this video of this uh, alfresco session um, unfortunately I couldn't take the key away um, so I'm gonna have to kind of think of a of a different way of doing it and I couldn't take this one away either um, I did drain the sump of the two machines though and what came out of it was a bit disgusting but anyway so that's kind of one job less to do um, and I took off the air cleaner uh, assembly from the compressor so at least that's that's one job less to do but other than that now I'm gonna have to go indoors and start cleaning uh, all sorts of things <laughs>